what is happening y'all welcome back at some dinner got the kids nice and sleepy and it's time for some character creation ah uh, man man oh man so we got to make um we got to make our official pawn we got to make our own character and then after that we got to make our uh our main pawn and then i'm debating on doing two playthroughs uh, i know I, I had a poll on the channel about you know do we do we stream or record what should we do and i don't know i mean my thing is if i get this early i know i'm not gonna just sit and wait for like i'm not gonna be able to i'm not like if i uh, so I keep saying if like, but, like when I get a review code for this There's absolutely no way I'm gonna be like, oh, well, I'm gonna wait to stream so I'm gonna sit on it a week and a half. So I think Either either I can record it and then when it's out I could be like we're gonna stream some side adventures or I could have a second save That's the stream character which might be the play because I have been still undecided uh, on my vocation. And so if I have a stream save and a recording save, I could try out more vocations. In which case, that means we got five characters we got to make. Save one Arisen, save two Arisen, save one Pawn, save two Pawn, and official Pawn. So this this might take a bit longer than I thought. Might take might take a bit longer than I thought. Either way, let's let's get our our official pawn up and running first. Let's get let's get the official pawn up. Summon your main pawn, the loyal companion who would accompany you through your venture, which they look like. Try to envision. Does it matter where where I collect it? Where where I, where I pick a slot? Okay, slot does not matter. I'm gonna, since it's gonna be, we're gonna like save one, save two, and then official. So, all right, Ugh. let's break it down. Official pawn. What what do I want the official pawn to be? Either I turn it into like a cat lady, I make it a mage, I make it a big a, a tank. I mean, it's it's gonna be gonna be an official pawn. I think Ruri actually made a tank. Let me see. He R Ruri posted his thing. Just straight up looks like a dwarf. He made it as dwarf as possible. It is a legit just a dwarf. Do they have a booty slider? Probably. I did say tank in the direct. I did say it's going to be the best tank. So, do we... If it has to be a tank, do we do we make... Should I make myself? Should I just make actual me? Or should I make, like, big cat man? should represent you and what you like in games which is usually beefy boys that is true beast ren tank if i make if i make it beast ren it's just gonna look like it's gonna look like my final fantasy 14 character who was a tank uh vote all right let's let's have we'll, we'll throw it up to a vote we'll let y'all decide The only downside of making myself is there's probably going to be weirdos out there that like get my pawn and try to do things with it. Like, oh, I got a cowboy's pawn and I'm stripping its clothing and I'm going to do things with it because it looks like him. Because there's weirdos out there, man. There are weirdos. Y'all vote. Give it a second.
comes with being on the internet. Yeah, well. It doesn't have to if I make Beast Cowboy. You put Dorian in his bed. Oh, God. Okay, give me one second. The kid just passed out. I gotta move him. Don't keep moving. I'll be right back. It's like as soon as I started, the uh, kid passed out. He was like just sitting in his chair. We were waiting for him to fall asleep. Okay. Oh, I'm out of breath. Sprinted down the stairs. All right. So, Beast Rain Cowboy it is. We got Mark with a bunch of gifts coming in. Appreciate that. I need to make him big dude this this is the biggest we need biggest adjust this face to suit your liking use the head you've chosen for base customization okay mm -hmm. i mean this one kind of looks looks big and big and, and ain't burly i'm liking that Hmm. This one's a maybe. This one, they look too skinny. Go with this one. Oh, yeah, the Grizzled War Veteran. I'm liking that one a lot. I'm liking that one. Maybe I think I'm thinking this one. We got a base head. Okay. So let's see. Uh, confirm back toggle redo close save. Fur. Should he be more fuzzy? I like. I think I like the fuzzy. Let's look at the pattern. So we could go like stripes. Spots. Uh, hmm. I like. I think I like the stripes. I like the stripes. Pattern colored presets. Some presets. Type eleven. I kind of like the 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 grayish. That's going on there. Type 4 or type 11. Let's start with like type 4. No, type 11 and then go from there. Actually, you know what? Hang on. Let me do like his hair first. 
So height. Is this is this centimeters? I think it's maybe it's centimeters. Two hundred. If it's centimeters, it means you can make your character seven foot or five two. I'm thinking he needs to be like. You know, how big is the mountain? How tall is the mountain? The mountain is 206 centimeters. So he's got to be at least as big as the mountain. At least as big as as uh, Bjornsson if he's going to be the tank. All right, torso length. I'm thinking, I'm thinking a pretty, not too long, because I want him to be a good kind of stout. So probably right there. Muscle style, muscle strength. Dude needs to be absolutely ripped. His traps should be gigantic. Upper body. He does not skip leg day. Probably like there. We want, we want, he's got to have some thickness. You know, he's got to be like a strong man. So we'll match it. We'll go 50 50 on that. Bjornsson is 6'9". Is I just looked it up. Hang on. I got I think I got to... I got to... Tone down the fur fuzziness. Otherwise, you can't see the muscles at all. A little bit, little bit of good shading on 34. 36. There we go. He's looking thick. This dude lifts weight. Uh, from what I understand, it's going to be on PC, but I think you'll be able to use the character creator code. He shaves so his muscles show through better. <laughs> I'm thinking this looks this looks thick. Do we need to do we need to pull pull the lower body in at all? Do we need to pull the Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe at like 25, yeah. Because we want him to be thick, but just built. We want that like farm strength. Otherwise, he's just, if we go, go max. Uh, all right, let me go 40. I think 40 is going to be, there we go. He's still, he still looks very big. Still looks big. All right, so now we got the base, the base body done. Let's. Oh no, we gotta do shoulders huge, chest huge, big old titties, torso, the depth. Arm length. Probably pull that to like eighty. Arm size jacked. Forearms jacked. Upper arm thickness jacked. Yeah, there we go. Now now we're now we're looking now we're starting to look more like a strong man. We're getting there. I ain't got the haircut done yet, Ruri. What are you doing? Go to bed. I'm making my cat man. I haven't I am not taking your your haircut. Not even done yet. Look at him. No, don't do it yet. All right, lower body. Waist. Probably like there. Waist size. Is this how he's got he's gotta have a little little bit like there. He's got to have that strong man belly where you can tell he's been, he's been, this dude carries rocks. Rear size. My man does not skip the glutes. Give him them cheeks. Max the cheeks out. Yeah, check out my cat's butt. 
Leg size overall. Leg size, gigantic. We do not skip leg day. Thighs, huge. Calves, huge. My guy is going to yeet you into the air. It's going to just be like, brah, and then throw you. All right. All right, now that we got that, now that we got that. Right, max this out. Max that back out. Those were maxed. Why were those unmaxed? Okay. All right. Where do we do? Oh, we haven't even. This is where you do hair and stuff. Okay, so we're still just on the body right now. He needs a bigger head. We, we haven't done anything with his head yet. We've just been we've been getting the frame. Maybe I got to pull in pull in his his waist a little bit. No, no, no. Waist is good. It wasn't there a. Waist was 16. I need his. Uh... there oh shit hang on oh no you fucking don't a stink bug tried to land on the computer we ain't fucking with that wonder if they're getting in through the mini split i don't know where they're coming from okay head <laughs> big head that's too big probably like i'm thinking like 70. i think that looks good that probably about four let's, let's focus focus on the head i think a wider wider head Probably like there at the depth. What is this changing? Neck thickness, max. Neck length. Neck neck can be on the little bit on the shorter side. Here we go. Alright, head looks good. I think that looks good for the body. Alright, let's before we do more, let me let me get my uh let me get my like hair and my beard done. That's that's important. I think the clear choice is this one. I think that that we already had four. I think four just makes sense. I think that's the clear beard, the warrior beard. Uh, hairstyle. What kind of hair would a cat have? Cat man. Do you have no hair? He looks so weird bald. I think he has to have like a thick mane. Like a big flowy mane. Which is what we already had. Okay. That's like the swept back. Maybe we keep that mane, man. I think the hair might I think the hair might be it. Big mane, big beard. Bust cut is done wild, right? Hey y'all, this is my cat. <laughs> what happened to him? The sheen, he's got luster in that hair. All right. All right, so what are we? What do we think? I think we're there. I think, I think the the hair, the face, the body look good. He looks. This dude looks like he he lifts weight. He moves weight. All right, now we got to do so. Good, 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 good posture, movement style. The 
This is the I'm gonna mess you up. I'm gonna mess you up walk. Angry arms. Let's give him the super angry arms. The angry walk. Posture. Puffs his chest out. Or he's just like. Rrr. I feel like he would be. That just looks weird. That looks like he's trying to like run away from himself. I feel like he would have a slight. I think he would have like a slight forward tilt. Because he's tall. So he's always looking down. So probably like right there. Does that look good? I think that looks good. All right, now we got to pick the fur, which really doesn't matter because he's going to be in armor half the time. But it's still important. 132. What is that? That is 291. That's an appropriate weight. That's an, that's an appropriate power lifter weight right there. Alright, this is the main color. I kind of like this like brownish, brownish gray that we have going on. Let's look through all of them though. So there's like a bright white. I like that. That's more of like a silver. I can't even tell the difference between them. So this is like, this is just like a general shading and shading on the face. I like the white there. This is like the secondary shading of the face. Maybe we go for a little lighter, like there for the third color. That is the, the edges, the edges. Hmm, maybe like a, maybe an orange. No, I don't know if I like the orange. I don't like the orange that much. Ooh, this is like a, a, a silvery. I kind of like that. It gives it almost like a bluish hue. And the color of the stripes. I kind of like the like gray, gray, silver and black thing he has going on. I'm, I'm, I don't know. Is there a different color I'd want for the stripes? The other option would be like make the skin darker, but I really like the like ashen white, you know, cause he's got like a little bit like the back's a little darker. It's got like a blue to it, almost like a Siberian tiger thing going on. Oh, I can do color intensity. Oh, I can just give it blue, dude. Oh, I like blue. I like blue. I like blue. Let's see. What is this one? I could really make that pop. I like that a little more dull. Maybe a pinch brighter like there. Okay, if I make that intense and then I go with like a white and then I let me dull it down just a pinch like there. Hmm. Like almost like an ashen, like an ashen color like there. Let me pull the, the blue hue down a little bit so you can like see a tinge of it. It is it is just looking like my Final Fantasy character at the moment. All 
Alright, I'm feeling pretty good. Let me darken that just a little. Oh, hang on. Detailed. Alright. Base head was chosen. Brow. Probably like... I mean, do they, they don't, he's a lion. He doesn't really have eyebrows. But like there, we'll keep it, yeah, just keep it like neutral. Brow depth. Brow bend. Eyes, eye height. He does have a big fucking forehead. <laughs> He's like, rah. Me. Brow. Squint left eye. I kind of, I mean, honestly, I'm kind of sold on like the squint with the scar. You know, like he has, he has, it's an old battle wound, so he can't really see out of that eye that well. Or we could just full on close it. I almost, I almost like this, this squint though. Is a squint is like he can he can still see a little bit, but maybe he doesn't have good like depth perception. Eye size. I don't see eye color though. Nose. I like the shorter nose. Bigger bridge. Bump nostrils. Flare those up just a pinch. That's a little shorter. Eyes. Oh, we'll get there. All right, let's just see. Ears. I mean, I don't know if the ears are going to matter because they're behind his hair. You're not going to really see the ears. So I think we can just ignore the ears. Cheek and neck thickness. He's got full cheeks. My man does not skip meals. Looks like one of those lions out in the savannah that hasn't eaten. No, we want them like, let's put them at like 72. You're not going to be able to see neck fat anyway. Wider cheeks, a little too wide. Pull it in a little bit. Well, we're going to get to the hair. We'll get there. Mouth. I'm like there. He's got to have a wide ass mouth, you know, like a jaw. Mouth protrusion. No, all the way out. All the way out. He's got to give him a bigger chin. He's got a little smile. No, he should be. I mean, I think like, right where he was at is pretty good. Like a little bit of a smirk. Pull that in a little. Because lines have, you know, they, they have like a, a built-in overblade. Jaw definition.
I want the chin to be a bit a bit on the softer side. It's still out. It's a little too wide for the mouth. I don't know, man. It's a it's a he's a lion person. I don't think that's too wide. I think he should be able to like bite half your face off if he opens his jaw. Right. I kind of like the like dirty blonde thing he has going on. So maybe I keep that and then for the tips. I mean, mouths are kind of as wide as eyes. Like if I if I go down from my eyes, I'm at the tip of my mouth. So it's not that weird. I kind of like a little a little bit of the like the dirty yellow in there. That looks kind of good. Or, ooh, 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 hang on. What if I go 139, 139, 130, where's 139? One, do that. And then the roots, we make the roots like a white. Ooh, I kind of like that. Like, as he's getting older, the gray hairs are coming through. All right, so quick, quick break. I'm seeing like a thousand questions, y'all. This is publicly available right now. It is not the full demo. It is a character creator, so you can make your character and make your pawn and get them ready so you don't have to spend an hour at launch. This is on every platform the game is releasing. This is not the full game. It's also not early access or anything. This is just... Literally, go to your platform of choice and, and type in Dragon's Dogma 2 and you'll find it. We're not going to start the game because there is no game to start. We are, this entire stream, we are making Catman and then we're going to make four more characters. We're making five characters. That's it. That's the whole stream. We're just going to be making characters. All right. So if you're expecting the gameplay to start, I'm just letting y'all know that's not, that's not going to happen. We're here to build characters. I have like a bunch of what where are you starting start the game start playing like that's that's not that's not what this is Well, maybe I get rid of the sheen because he probably wouldn't have well hang on let me add sheen and then Yeah, no, no what no sheen no sheen I want it to be not that's too white. But I do like the root idea that I had going on. Like he's slowly as he gets older, he's getting white hair like that maybe. When am I starting the game? In like 2 weeks when it comes out. So if you just stay here for 2 weeks and you come back, it'll be game time. All right, beard. Well, what did I go for the, the hairstyle? I went 181, 181 on the beard. No sheen. You no, know, you know what? I feel like facial hair, I can, I can keep the same color. Actually, even maybe darker on the roots. Because my facial hair is darker than, than most of my hair. It's like pulling the blue pigmentation. Okay, I'm liking that. Got 
got like a couple of the little grays popping up. Alright, face preset patterns. Uh, I figured scar would be. Wait, base pattern. Oh, it's like the. Um. I like the darker top, so we'll keep that. Unless there's there's also a nun. I think I like the darker forehead. I like that. Maybe I'll pull it in a little bit to like there. Where's the, like the, put a little bit of blue there. Oh, it's the tip of his nose. Okay, let's give that, like, uh, I think we'll keep that black. Intensity. The eyes. Edit each eye. No, we'll keep, all right, type one, type two. Oh, fuck yeah. Okay, hang on. Edit each eye separately. Left eye, we're gonna do... Oh, hang on, let me let me look through the eyes first. So, type 3 is like clouded. So we're gonna do type 3 on that one. And then for the right eye... He's gotta have a cat eye. That... Oh, there's like a yellow... I can change, let me change the lighting. All right, we'll go default for now. Uh, right eye presets. What was that? What, there was one, I, ooh. I kinda like type 11. Hang on, we're gonna, we're gonna edit. We're gonna blur that one eye after. I wish I could get a better look at his eye color. Ooh. That one looks like that's like the eye of Sauron. I don't know. I'm kind of feeling 11. That one's pretty cool, too. All right. I style four. Now we're going to edit and we're going to turn this one into three. So it's been, you know, damaged and it's it's hazy. Pupil size. I could keep that. Pull it down a little bit. Where's uh eyes? I want to make his eye eye size is already as big as it goes. No, maybe I change it up a little bit. Maybe this. I'm not liking the green as much. Let's go for like 272 in that. Cats don't really have eyelashes. Teeth. P 
pearly whites. Probably a, I don't want like bright bright. Probably like there. Maybe six. There's claws. Um, here, there we go. Oh, where's you can only kind of see him over here. Um, give him like the blue. You know, the more I'm looking at them, I don't know if I like the... Now that I'm, like, looking at them backed out, I don't think I like the white roots anymore. But I think pulling from that blue would look good. It's, like, the same color as is... Have that color, like, bleeding into his hair, that blue. Yeah. All right, tattoos. A lot of presets. Does do I want him to have tattoos? I think I want him to have scars. I don't know about tattoos. I'm thinking more scars. Let's look through the presets. Oh, he's got a bunch. Hmm. All right, let's 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 go through scars. I don't even see where I can pick the the face scar. Would it be under body? Oh, it is body scar. Scar two. Ooh, I can make it a big one. Oh. Would it be, should I go for the claws? I kind of like the jagged one, but this, this is like a torture scar, you know? Like there's not many things in the wild that would make a scar that's like, nah, 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 nah. This is like, he got hit in the eye. But could it have been a fight and somebody slashed him? Hmm. Let me lower the scale a little bit, and then I'm going to I like that. How do we how do we feel about that one? Like the bigger one, I'm thinking. Hmm. <sighs> Vertical or horizontal tilting? Whoa. Oh, tiling. Overall scale. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Let's 
Got big scars on his arm. Maybe not that big. Maybe like there. Well, no, his left arm is his, his tanking arm, so let me... The right arm, he slashed and then something got him. But the left arm, this is his tanking arm, so... Maybe he has, he has a... Yeah, ooh, like a burn, you know, because he was blocking, but this was, was... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's do that one, uh... Oh, vertical position, we gotta... You know, he had he had a burn scar from blocking and the fire went off his shield and it torched his upper half. I like how our dude is a fucking backstory, man. Did the claw scar on his chest? But I mean most of the time he'd have armor on. You know? I think he could have... Let's do this this one. Like at one point, it's like, ah, well, they, were, they were tearing up his midsection. But he was fighting him off like the badass he is. Or you know what? Right arm? Let's let's drop the right arm. But on his right leg, put a big cuz that's if he was going to have claw marks, it would be on the leg, you know? It would be like something something uh You were he went into swing. I'm trying to I'm trying to think how this was. so if like he's swinging and the cat's going at him. Be like, wow. So, like, other other way. I gotta rotate it. Drown like that way. Yeah, yeah. Except, except the cat. Let's let's make it go vertical. Yeah, like it tore into his thigh. Oh, that's a that's a deep one. That's a deep one. I like that. He was fighting in the. A, a big monster right through his leg. Sword fighter needs a shoulder scar. You mean like this one, bro? From the fire that came off of his shield? That he blocked? Dirt? No, nah, he ain't dirty. He may he may have uh, some issues, but he showers. Hmm. All right, how are we feeling? How are we feeling about our dude? I'm. I'm thinking he's good. I think I'm happy with him. Yeah, exactly. Ain't, ain't no fucking scars on the back. Scar on his back from the lovemaking with his wife. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Uh, vocation. I mean, to start, he's going to be a fighter. I think eventually I'm going to turn him into a, a warrior, though. Inclination. What would we want here? Straightforward? I feel like this straightforward, candid, flippant, and impulsive. 
I feel like you'd want your tank to be calm, rational, shrewd, strategizing, characterized by caution, favors defense and evasion. But see, I don't, I, I, I want him to favor defense, but not really evasion. Like, I feel like if I was making a thief, straightforward makes sense. But at the same time, isn't this going to get him more? I, I guess my, my what's simple, uh, curious, earnest and adventurous, always exploring and gathering items. The question is, will calm. Because we, we want him to be in the front line. Kindhearted sounds more of like a support pawn. Yeah, that's the question. Does does calm calm mean uh, characterized by caution, favors defense and evasion, and playing clever tactics to survive? So like stunning something, running, or is straightforward mean he's gonna jump right in and he's gonna tank everything? God, I wish we had, <sighs> let me, hold on. Let me pull up the inclinations. So if we're going by the old game, Acquisitioner was looting, Pioneer was spread out and scout ahead. That's kind of what Simple is. It sounds like Simple is Pioneer and Acquisitioner. In the old game, Guardian and Nexus, Guardian and Nexus were like defensive and aid focused. Medicant was healing. Utilarian was teamwork. Scather, Mitigator, and Challenger were all about combat. Straightforward sounds like Scather, Mitigator, and Challenger just all combined into one. Well, and let, let me see. Are we going to be able to, to turn him into a fighter? Or a, a warrior? Let's see. Dogma to Pawn Inclinations. Where's the... Let me, go, let me just go to the website. Dragon's Dogma. Let me just go to the actual Dragon's Dogma 2 website. Um, let's see. I still have that up. Um, character. Where are... Where's the inclinations? Locations. Let's check that. Because I'd want to turn him into a warrior eventually. Um, but I don't know how they're how they're doing. Can we can pawns be warrior and sorcerer, and then it's only hybrids and warfare for, or is are pawns now limited to just the basics? Dragon's Dogma 2. Yeah, your pawn won't be able to use it until level 10. You're aiming to upgrade your pawn into a warrior. Yeah. Well, they can do advanced, but not hybrid. 
So if we're going to turn him into a warrior, I think straightforward versus calm. Shanti. Oh, how do we, uh... <coughs> people here are evacuated and safe. People here are evac... People here are... People here are... People here are... The people here are evacuated and safe. The people here are... The people here are... The people here are... The people here are... Just keeps getting higher. For the moment. There are more who can yet be saved. I think we'd have to go with that. It seems the rain has abated. There are more who can yet be former. Or it seems the rain has abated. There are more who can. There are more who can yet be saved. Danger might lurk anywhere, where every shadow, and mind the ceiling. Former arisen appear to be plentiful in this world. Danger might lurk any splendid work, master. Of course, I never doubt you <laughs> for a moment. Splendid work, master. As you say, I shall remain here till you give the word. I shall lead us to our destination. So do try not to rush ahead. I'm thinking one. Are there different voices for the inclinations? Yes, I believe so. So if we go calm. The people here are evacuated. The people here. The people. The people here are evacuated and safe. For the moment. The people here are evacuated. The people here are. The people here are. The people here are evacuated and safe. There are more who can yet be saved. It seems the rain has abated. Hmm. What does simple sound like? The people here are evacuated and safe. For the moment. It sounds the same. The people here are evacuated and safe for the moment. We're going straight forward, nonchalant one. The people here are evacuated and safe for the moment. Okay. Uh, we gotta have. We gotta have a monk gear for him. We gotta name him. What do we name him? Zangief. Zuma. Yamato. So these are just names for people that have it censored. M. Bison. Eagle. What would be a good name for him? Claw. <laughs> that's just that's just the moniker. Um, Agar. Do they have mountain? Let's see. They have Magnus. I like Magnus. Magnus. Ah, oh, well now, now what do we actually name him? <sighs> name him after one of your cats? My cats have very vanilla names. His name would just be Jack. That's it. Jack and Frank. Bartholomew? Oh, is that is that is that one of the options? It is not. Billy, <laughs> bitey face. <laughs> Bob, Bowie, Bosch, Buster. Uh, he's a cat man, just named Dog. <laughs> I 
I'm still liking Magnus. Usashi. Ulysses. Ooh, that's a good one, too. I like that over Magnus. Oh, man. I'm so bad with names, bro. This is why all of my... Every time I play a game, I just come up with, like, the dumbest names possible for stuff. Like, I have my, uh, my current names in... Last Epoch are like Mommy Milkers, Shooty Lady, Mage Man, and like Unga Bunga or something. Unga Bunga. <laughs> I'm here to get in. <laughs> Oh, man. <sighs> mm. I don't know, man. Oh, could I could I name him Mr. Thick? Is that can I confirm that? Can we go? Can we go, Mister Thick? Cause he big. He's a he's a big boy. Bigums. Hmm. Moose. Oh, God, I'm so bad with names, bro. Chungus. Hmm. I mean, you got to remember this. This is going to be this is an official pawn. This guy will be in the game for perpetuity forever. So I probably shouldn't just name him Chungus. I mean, I could. Ah, uh, yes. The official pawn Chungus. <laughs> like. I mean, just name him Chad. <laughs> I kind of like Chad. Um, I'm not doing Garagus. That's so weird. Oh, what about um? Oh fuck! What's his name? Um. I could name him like Godfrey after Elden Ring. Godfrey. I mean, Godfrey seems like a good name for a cat. I have given thee courtesy enough. I don't know, man. I'm kind of, I'm kind of leaning. 
I don't want to do Horaloo. God like Godfrey sounds better than Horaloo. All right, let's let's do it. All right, so either Godfrey for like a serious name, Chungus, or ooh Sirash. Yeah, that was like his. That was like the name of the the cat with Godfrey. I like that. I like that. I do like that. He does. Let me. Let me actually. I think he. He probably looks close to Sirash. Uh, Sirash is more like pure white. But he could have the name. But I like Godfrey too. All right, so we got two, two serious names, one potential joke name. Does sound noble. All right, Sirash is taking, taking it. Now, do I want to make him look more like Sirash? I mean, Sirash is kind of vanilla looking, like... I think he looks fine, yeah. Do I want to change the hair at all? Maybe, I mean, go to the... Let me go to detailed... I think I want the hair slightly lighter. Let me go to like 140 on it. Is he done? Is this it? I, th I mean, he does look like a pretty badass cat. Real fast, let me... Let me see what the head would look like if I didn't do the roots. I made that like 140 as well. No, I think I like the I think I like the roots. I think I like the roots. Monkier. I mean the, the the moniker I always call it Monkier. The moniker is only relevant in certain chances. So in the original um, doo -doo 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 -doo. 
Basically, if somebody has parental controls enabled, they'll just see this name instead. So that that really doesn't matter like 90% of the time. But I don't know what I would change it to anyway. Alright, I think I'm happy with him. Oh man, he looks he looks cool. Let me I wanna I wanna uh I want to get a good picture of him. I'm happy with him. All right. Uh, so now I need to create my character. What's your build going to be? I don't know. I think I'm kind of discussing doing two playthroughs, like record one and then stream one. So the recording playthrough will probably be I don't know man. I'm leaning I'm leaning towards Mystic Spearhand a lot. No, that was that was my official pawn. All right, so we're going to make two separate characters, one, let's go, let's, we're just going to make a human for one and then a beast run for the other. I think for the stream, I'll do beast run for the first playthrough, I'll do human. So this one is easy. We're just going to make this one, we're just going to make this one look like me. This is this is the official this is going to be the cowboy the cowboy arisen. Mm. Mm. What would I further customize down? Start there. The skin is way too fair, but I can change that. I'm mainly looking at like facial structure. Maybe that one? I don't know. I don't really have I don't have that I don't have that dude's brow. He's got that like lump thing. I don't I don't really got a brow like that. Maybe I start with this and then I just edit the face. Let's let's try that and see if we Get away from the... It's Leon Kennedy! What are you doing here? No. Let's go with this one, and then... Mm. This dude looks like he's had a bad day at work. He had to wake up at 4 a.m. to get to work, and the doors were still locked.
I mean, they all kind of look dopey, bro. Where am I supposed to go from here? These are all just like presets. And I need to take one and then I need to transform it. So let me just go through with like that. And then probably that. All right, we'll do that as our base look. All right, height. Let's see, body height. I am, what is 186 centimeters. He doesn't have muscles yet. We gotta, we gotta add some mass onto this man. Add mass. Mass. Add too much mass. Right there. Let's go like 50 and then 50. I think that's what we did before. Traps. My traps are looking looking pretty good these days, I think. Let's go like uh let's go uh like like there. There. Give him all the muscle strength. Yeah, he just needs that creatine, man. That's it. All right. Muscle type. Got some definite. I like that. It's got that 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 strongman definition. It's borderline fat. Tell me you don't know how to power lift without telling me you don't know how to power lift. We haven't even got to the waist yet, bro. Relax. All right, shoulders. The human almost looks disproportionate when you do the shoulders. My shoulders are my shoulders are looking pretty pretty good lately. All right, probably like let's go like there. Chest gotta have them them. Chest is probably good where it's at. Hold on the size, torso width, pull in a little bit, torso depth. Arm size. Shoulder width, let me pull in the shoulders a little bit because it almost looks unnaturally weird there we go we're looking we're looking at like a good amount of mass now good amount of mass Bruh. hold it into like there but i got them like i got them long ass arms Let's see how let's see how long my arms are. Hold on, let's see. My arms, yeah, my arms go down to my thigh. So we can give, we he can have them. He's got them big old monkey arms. And then we're gonna have to bump up, put the torso depth up. Okay. Thicken up the chest a little bit. Let me pull pull the arms in slightly. There we go. Got them gorilla arms. That's right. Lower body waist. Probably like there. 
was a waist size. I like his tummy. There. Leg size, just fucking max it out, bro. My legs are fucking huge. It's about how thick my ass is. It's, it's, it's ginormous. But now it's looking off. Maybe I gotta, I might have to pull, I might have to pull the legs in slightly. No, that's pretty close, I think. That looks, I'd say that's pretty close. I think it's the shoulder size that's off. If I put that up, there we go. It's looking, it's looking a bit closer. There we go. Now he's now he's looking like a, a more proper thick boy. It's a dumpster truck of an ass, bro. When you're I deadlift and squat every week, okay? When all you do is lift heavy weights. All right, the glutes, the glutes are are a very potent muscle. We'll get to we'll get to the head. Relax. We'll get there. His head is is too small. I'm probably there. Eh, come on, get to the face, get to the face. Okay, let's see. I got, I think I have a pretty wide head. I need to, uh, how wide is my head? I think, mm, do I have a wide head? All right, hang on, we gotta, let me, all right, since we're, so we're gonna do this. We gotta add a filter. We gotta add. No, hang on. Is it property. Effect filters. Image mask and blend. I think. Oh, no, I don't want image mask. I want, um, what do I want here? Color key, color correction. Would color correction work? It'll take the green screen away, shit. I just want to add, wait, there we go, okay. All right, we got to <laughs> All right, uh, that looks uh, uh... All right, so that's that's almost the right size. I think I got to go a little bit bigger so the eyes and the mouth match up. How creepy is that? Let me hang on, let me flip this. So I can, I can look at it better. Well, no, if I'm going to have it over here. Actually, it might make sense to, no, I'll have to have the game up. Okay. All right. I'll, give me, give me a second. Let me get to, let me get to the, the face overlay part. Let's get to the face overlay part and then we'll, we'll, we'll do that. All right. A couple things. Let's first, we're going to fix the hair up. We're gonna fix the hair. Uh, I the closest thing in this game is probably that, or the mohawk. No, I don't like. I'd probably go for the mohawk because I usually have like like a fade, a really low fade. This is like a fade, but it's a fade with a ponytail. There's that one. That's kind of close, but it, I don't really go for the top knot thing. Let's go for the mohawk. Do I want the mohawk or the fade? Uh, let's go with the mohawk for now. And the color would be... Yeah, 
Yes. That looks pretty close. Okay, facial hair. Right now it's closer to that because I've shaved, but it's usually a bit longer. But I don't have I don't have it sectionalized like that, so we're gonna have to go with this one, I think. I think four is gonna be what we'll have to do. Let me look though. Okay, let's do that. I want 121. 121 and then 123. No, actually that doesn't look that right. Let's get this. I'll be closer to the 123. And my hair is actually a little bit lighter. God, it's way bushier than I like my beard, though. But that's too clean cut. Like, I usually have that more than I'd have this, because this is just a big stash. I don't do the stash thing. Maybe I can do this and like increase the thickness or something. Go with eight. That? You're talking hair. No, I would need to be able to like add, add a second hairstyle for that. Or there's the, the like, the top not fade. No, that looks weird. Um, fuck. It's too scruffy. Way too scruffy. Way too scraggly. Yeah, I think we're sticking with the mohawk. Body hair. We'll get to that. Alright, I gotta get the face. Alright, let's see. Head, base head. Alright, now we can now we can overlay. His head's his head's too skinny. I need to like Alright, we're gonna let me let me uh da 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 uh. Let's get it closer and then we'll we'll match up. We'll we'll do the matching after after we get we get closer to being done we'll uh we'll match it up so mm, i have a fairly oval face this one just looks angry the fuck where did goddamn bucks keep coming from What the fuck? You get some of these are just cursed looking. My hair is not red at all. There's no more ginger than black. Like I don't have the slightest tinge of red in my hair. The 
That one's kind of an overly face. Let's select that for now, and then we'll keep changing. That one might be better. No, 21's still better. Jesus. All right, I think we're going to keep the one we got. We'll keep 21. Yeah, we got to we got to get our get our skin or still skin color. Uh where is the pale as fuck option? 5. 5 is probably the most pale so far. That's is that more pale? That's got a little bit of color, whereas that's that's more like a true pale. Make him fucking moist and glistening. No, my hair is not on the red side at all. My hair is not on the red. Listen, the lights above me are yellow okay it's yellow see how see how my my hair kind of turns yellowy from the lights literally oh my god I swear to god look look i don't know why this people people are so confused about how lighting dynamics work They're like i always thought you were a redhead This is literally from from the stream today from the stream today right notice how it's brown now notice how up top where the light is coming down it looks lighter this this is not red there is no red i don't know why this is is so confusing for people it's like it's like a regular thing be like i swear yeah it's, just, it's always been red right bro like no there's a reason my beard looks brown because the light hits my like if I sh if I if I cover the light oh my god would you look at that it's like I have brown hair all of a sudden You think it's that? That now we're getting more into like strawberry blonde. Maybe there. Listen, I got nothing against gingers. My cousin is is full on ginger. Okay. I just don't I don't like being mischaracterized. It'd be like if people were like, oh yeah, cowboy's black. No, I'm very clearly not black. Gingers are always defensive. All right, man. Whatever, whatever you say. Sure. People get, they get obsessed with it. It ain't, it ain't even about being shamed, bro. It's, it's about, it's, it's. I don't, I don't like getting called on things that I am not. That's all. That's literally all it is. That is, that is what it boils down to. You could, you could, you could even, you could even apply it to things outside of looks. Like people are like, oh yeah, cowboy, he's a, he's a pro COD player. No, I am not. I don't even play COD. Same thing. I would be like, no, no. Why? Why are you saying I'm a COD player? I don't. I don't play COD. I just don't. I don't like. I don't like incorrect generalizations. Maybe it's like an OCD thing. Okay. I don't know. I just. 
I mean, it's the same as when when I'm like playing a game, like I'm doing like like I'll, I'll be doing like a let's play, and someone's like, "Is this a walkthrough?" I'm like, "No, it very clearly says let's play. It does not say walkthrough. It does not say. Nowhere does this say guide." Yeah, Cow Cowboy's not a pro cowboy. What do you mean, bro? Glistening. Two gliss. Where do we go back? We got to go back to Sheen. Where's, where's Sheen at? I don't need my guy looking like he's, he's glistening in the sunlight. All right, that's the right amount of pale, though. I got the freckles down already. The freckles are just... I don't even know. You, you probably can't even... I do... I have freckles. They're, like, very light, though. Can you see them? Do I have the freckles? I do have freckles. But they don't really come out unless it's, like, the summer. When it's the summer, I get freckles. <laughs> He's the sun because... Alright, fuck it. I give up with y'all. Y'all are ridiculous. My skin does have like a very slight sheen. Let's go like 16. Brow. I feel like I have a pretty, pretty narrow brow. Probably like there. Mm. Um. See, this is this is when we got to do the the overlay thing. Because now we're getting into, like, face shape and shit. So, let me... Move this here. Let me do the opacity. Let's see. Uh, chroma. We'll do it at, like, like, 50. Like, there. There we go. I gotta make this bigger. Yeah. Okay, the brow the brow looks the brow looks pretty close. But my eyebrows are much lighter. It's really hard to, to do this and I think I need to uh I need to be looking straight at this. No, all right, let me let me bring it back down some. Where is my webcam? At? Come here. All right, let me just I'm just going to keep the webcam bigger for now. And I'm just going to keep it with that same. All right, so brow, brow looks good. I, I have very, very thin eyebrows. They're very, very thin. We'll get there. Brow spacing, though. It's probably good like there. I don't have... Mm. Yeah, I think I think when we're done, we'll superimpose it. So like there maybe the brow depth. I don't I have like no brow depth. Nice. Maybe like maybe like there. I don't have a lot of brow depth. Okay. Dude, the best thing about this is getting this done now is when I finally start the game, I can just pick my character and boom, I can jump right in. I don't gotta... I'm not gonna spend time making them because I can make them absolutely perfect now. So I have like... My eyebrows are pretty soft with a very slight bend. Probably there. Okay. Brow bend. Probably close to neutral on that. Eyes. 
Mm. Probably right, probably close to the mid. Wide. I think my eyes are kind of wide. No, that's how close they are together. Um, probably... Probably neutral. Depth. I think mine are back a little bit. I think I have kind of big eyes. I'm mean, there. Angle. I don't think I have any angle. Nose. I got a pretty big nose. Probably. Mm. Hang on, I gotta change the angle of it first. Right there. Does that, does that look right? That. Uh, I gotta, hang on, let me turn him. Let me turn him. Turn around. Turn around so we can see the nose. Is that. Oh, damn it. It's bad. I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to make him, make him look this way. So the nose is in the middle of the screen. Okay, it's kind of close. My nose is much, much bigger though. I got like a wider nose. Bridge width. Well, no, the top isn't. The very top is, is actually not that wide. So probably there. Where's the height of my bridge? Right at like the tops of my eyes. So like there, pick up the tip and widen the bridge. Um, bridge bump? I don't really have much of a bridge bump, so I'll leave that default. I feel like I need I need more I need more volume in the nose. Nostril width would maybe help with that. Yeah, a little bit there. And then, no, I don't really have a lot of nostril height, though. I think that's getting there. There we go. Now it's looking, it's looking a bit more. I need, uh... I think that's that's looking pretty good. Right, right, right. What do I gotta change here? Uh, no, maybe I'm pointing it out too much. It's hard because I need to like I'm trying to turn this way to match it up, but then I can't look at the the image. Less tip sharpness. Oh, there we go. That'll wide. They're perfect. That's what I needed. I just needed this guy. That. So I got. I got. I got pretty. Pretty big ends. So like right. Probably there. Now. Now we got. Now we got my nose. Now I got my nose. And then probably the tip angle. I can. I can adjust that to like there. There we go. I think that I think that looks I think that looks appropriate. Is that that looks good. I think that's it. I think I'm happy cuz I got I got like the nice the nice bridge little bump right there. All right, that's good. All right, ears. I don't know. I got <laughs> I have uh I have very far back ears, damn. You can almost not even see my ears, but they're big. So let's like increase size, but then pull them back like that. Oh, look, you can make an elf. My ears are, are not very elfy. Like there. There. Uh. 
ears look so weird, bro. Cause I, you can barely see my ears. I'm really there, I guess. Man, I've never looked at ears. Ears are really weird to like design. I'm just gonna leave ears alone. I don't give a fuck about ears. All right, cheeks. I got them big cheeks. Maybe not that big, cause I lost some weight, but there's still some thickness there. There's some. Uh, <gasps> guys, I've been on a diet. I haven't been eating. I got full cheeks. Not that full, but full. All right, cheek bulge. Pretty thick cheeks. Neck fat. Let's see, neck fat. No. Hmm. Oh, we would probably default on that. And then let's widen out the cheeks. To like there. And then I got a, a decent amount of cheek depth. No, well, actually, maybe I don't. My cheeks are pretty. That. Uh, I gotta pull the cheek bulge in, decrease width and depth slightly. We, I think we're getting a lot closer to the face though. Ronan news on the 11th, indeed. I think we're getting, I think we're getting closer to the face. Mouth. Mouth protrusion. Mm. I think my mouth's pretty straight in the middle. Let me go like I need to get let me let me do the jaw before I do the mouth. It's so hard to know what this is doing with the beard. It looks like it's pulling more to the side. Hmm. Remove beard and put it back after. I mean, there's no point because the beard is going to. Probably there. Closer to that. Chin. Not have a sharp chin. It's very rounded. Okay. I mean, I think that's looking pretty close. Are we are we at the overlay step? Um I got a, I think I made it too big. Eyes, no, let me just scroll this out a little. Mm. 
So... I need to pull... I need to pull in... I need to pull the eyes in a little bit. I gotta pull in the eyes. Wait, why are you going off screen? Get back here. So I think I just need to, I need to pull, pull the eyes. And then I think, is it nose height or is that size of the, the eyes need to be closer. My nose doesn't have this flare that the character does. So I got a nose flare, closer eyes. Lips look right. Okay, I think everything else is good. The nose flare and the eyes have to be a bit closer. Where's opacity at? There we go. All right, eyes, eye width, uh, probably there. No, probably, no, that's probably too much like there. And then a nose, is it nostril? Pull that in. What was it at? Nostril width was 31. Is it... Just put the nostrils in and up. So that would be... Is it 10? So like there. Like that. Jaw. I'm going to round out the jaw. Let's see. Where would that be? No, I think that would be jaw position. Yeah. Bro, you can say in and up. You gotta. T what, what do you want adjusted? Okay, you gotta. You gotta tell me what I'm adjusting here. There we go. Right there. I think that's looking pretty close. Smaller eyes? Really? I think my eyes are pretty... I think I got pretty big eyes. More nostril height. Alright. Eyes. Let me... Do, 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 do. Webcam. Hang on, I'm trying to lock a bunch of shit so I stop accidentally grabbing it while I'm doing this. Okay.
I think I need to make this a little bigger. I think I made the eyes, I gotta pull them in a little bit more. The eye size looks good. The nose still flares out a little bit. I don't know if I can adjust that. Everything else I think looks good. Your head is wider. It is. I don't know if I can increase the size of the forehead though. Like how big the head is. I'll have to look. Do that, and then I with bring him a pinch closer. Head, ah, yeah, I don't think I can. I don't know. There's not really a forehead adjustment, so I don't think I can do that. I think I just gotta, I gotta keep the forehead the way it is, um. Unless there's something I can do. Yeah, no, not to the base head. Squint the eyes a little. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I see that. Eye depth. The bridge looks good. I don't, I think, I think we're good. I'm gonna sink in the eyes. I think they're, my eyes aren't that sunken, are they? Maybe I'll end up with headgear. Maybe I won't. Maybe I want to look at my dude. I think like there. I do think the squint, though. All right. Hairstyle. I am, I guess, happy with that. Uh, eyebrows. Shape. I got some thin ass eyebrows. They're thin, but they're kind of like wispy. Maybe that one. But I gotta change the color. My eyebrows are like a blonde. So probably let's do 42 as a baseline. Um ooh, 118, that looks good. Let me make him a little bit thicker. But still like wispy looking. Now that might be the best bet, and I just Like there. I think that's good. The cheeks are pretty round already. Nostrils still need to be thinner. Bruh. There's only so much I can do with the nostrils before it just gets sunken in. Screw it. That's it. That's the new nose. We're keeping that. There we go. My cheeks already got fat, bro. See, if I do more of the cheeks, it pushes the jaw out. So we gotta... 
I had to do that and then. Now the jaw looks weird. It's sitting too far back. It's rounder. Oh, position. If I was 10 years younger and absolutely shredded, bro, listen, there's a difference between static muscle and active muscle, all right? I'll tell you what, you, you come to the gym while I am mid-workout and you will see how bulked I am. I think the cheeks are a little too big. Uh, I don't like that. Is there any reason as to why we decided to not go with a playable demo? I don't know, man. I ain't fucking Capcom. <laughs> I'm just the dude that was invited to host. It in a little bit, maybe. The face is very square. I'm trying to think what I can do to change that, though. I think my face is a bit rounder. Body hair. Just shit tons of it. Wow, it's too dark. But isn't like a good brown. I guess we're just going with that. Damn, the dream to have no body hair on the back. I wish, bro. I gotta shave this shit on a regular. My dude was blessed with those back jeans. I think the head size is small. Face height. Not that thick neck. Oh, that kind of, that helps round it out a bit. There we go. I mean, I got a pretty big forehead though. I mean, like there. Rounder nipples. You have issues. Nice. I think I gotta do pull in the traps slightly. All right, I think we're good. All right, eyes. Eye style, let's see, type one. Uh, 
Do I have big pupils? I feel like I have pretty small pupils. I mean, there isn't really a coppery type hair, though. Um, it just gets lighter unless I go to like here, but it's not orange. Maybe that one. Okay, uh, where was I going? Eyes. So, I need to look at my eyes. Ah, damn, there's too much graininess on the camera. I get a good check on my eyes. I'm just going to take a picture looking directly into the camera. Okay, I got a good I got a good picture of my eye. Man, you ever take a picture of your eye and look at it like really close up? It's kind of weird. So, the very center of my eye, we got like a little bit of almost like a like a greenish blue, like a teal in there. So something like that, maybe it's a little darker than that. Oh, hmm. Center has Like that. Okay, now this is the main color of the iris. My eyes are like a very light blue, like a cloud almost. So probably there. And then around the very rim, it's a little bit darker. So like that. Iris size. Bugging out eyes. Um, mine are probably, probably, eh, probably like defaulty right there. Let me go zero because I don't. I think I have pretty good size irises like there. Okay. Eyelashes. I have long eyelashes. They would make your wife jealous. I guess type two.
I got a funny story. When I was a kid, I've always had like really long eyelashes. When I was a kid, uh, one of my sister's friends was like, he's like, oh, you have long eyelashes. And I was like, no, I doubt. I, you know, I don't know how old I was. I didn't make it a nine or ten. She's like, oh, you have, you have long eyelashes like a pretty girl. And I got really upset about it being a kid, obviously. And I went home and I took scissors and I tried to cut, I tried to cut my eyelashes down and make them shorter. Which then, when I tried to go outside, I was like, oh my god, I'm blind! Because your eyelashes provide your, uh, your pupil with, like, natural shading. So, uh, yeah, never cut your eyelashes. So uh, you're gonna, it's gonna be a very bad time. I mean, they grew back, obviously. And they're, I think, longer than they used to be. But now I just fucking kill it, because I'm like, that's right. Y'all long-ass beautiful eyelashes. A shadow. Uh, don't need any eyeshadow. Eyeliner, none. Freckles. Um, probably a type two. So I get most of my freckles on my nose. Probably there. Orangish. Yeah, I think that looks good. Cheeks. Cheek style. Oh, let's leave that. Lips. Teeth. Mm, fine with teeth. Uh, tattoos. I got no tattoos. I got no scars. <laughs> um, What? Should we give him scars? Let me let me look at some of the tattoos. Oh yeah, I can get some some bores on my nipples. <laughs> just, just slap them up. Yeah, right, right there. <laughs> oh my god, dude! Right, right there. <laughs> <laughs> right on the nips. It's it's perfect. <laughs> we are not doing them on the nips. Um I kinda like the Medusa. The Beast Claw. Uh, the twin Dragon. I don't know what that's supposed to be. An angry face. I want to get it. I want to put, put the... Uh, It's like a Goblin Slayer tattoo. Uh, I don't know, man. What do I want? The only reason I don't have tattoos is I've never liked something enough to get it like inked on me for good. I've thought about it a few times and I'm always like, eh. The closest I've come was getting, uh, getting the Mark of Sacrifice from Berserk. I was thinking about doing that. And just never did. I can't show actual gameplay. This isn't the game, bro. It's the character demo. I could get him like give him a give him a tramp stamp or like a like uh like ah uh, yes uh if you open my pants you'll find my snake 
<laughs> be so fucking trashy. <laughs> this is where my cobra lurks. <laughs> Okay, all right. No, no, no tattoos. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I don't know. Do I want a tattoo? I don't know. See, I'm just, I'm bad with tattoos, man. I'm like, none of them, like, appeal to me that much. Maybe I'll get, uh, maybe I'll do a, uh, on his arm, I'll do like a Goblin Slayer. I got like a little goblin slayer tat on the arm. I like that one. Um, what about lower body? Nope, hang on. I want to go to tattoos. Um, body scars. Let's give him a scar. Let's give him uh, give him some stitches across his kidney. Um, let's do like, uh, mm, no, that's dumb. Um, I don't know, man. He's gonna be in armor most of the time. Maybe I just stick with my Goblin Slayer tattoo. And we're good. I think I gotta, I gotta downsize the legs slightly. Rear, he's got that big old ass. And I do got big thighs, but they're not like that big. Probably like there. Let's go like 50 50 on it. Alright, that looks a bit better. Vocation! Ah, how tall am I? Six one. We gave him my exact height. Let's let me actually go to detailed and see. So height, where does weight? Weight is one oh one oh six. Let's see. Hundred and six kilograms would translate out to two thirty three. So pretty close. Pretty close. I was at at to, uh, I was close to 240 a little bit ago. I gotta, let me try, let me see if I could increase to, I want to get to my, my proper weight, which would be, I'm close to 250 right now. So let's see if we, let's get up to 113. I got to add enough mass that I'm at 113. I don't know if we're going to be able to. It's going to make him thicker. Give him that boulder shoulders. Up to 110. 111. I get up to 113. 
Even going max depth on torso, or don't hit it. It's, it's got to be in the legs. If I give him them thick boy legs, he hits it. Is the head the right size? Or does the head need to be big? I think the neck needs to be bigger. There we go. Dude looks like 405 is his warm up on incline bench. <laughs> Dude, I was so fucking close to hitting 300 the other day though. We were doing uh we were doing floor press. And we just kept going up and up and up and I banged out 300 for I think it was like six reps. And then I was like, let's go. Let's fucking just toss it on. And I was just too gassed. I like got it down and was just like gah, 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 gah. There was just no there was no juice left in the tank. And now the real question, what vocation do I want to hit? Well, it was, it was floor press though. So, well, typically my trainer is a big brain. We usually, you know, floor press is when you're literally laying on the floor. So the big thing is when you're pressing, you're, you can't go past this. So you're not able to drive. So you got to hit the floor and go up. And he was like, that floor is dirty. We're not doing that. And I was like, well, how are we going to do floor press? And he just grabbed two more benches and then slapped them next to the bench press bench. So it was just like a tri bench and that my, my elbows couldn't hit. So, in terms of vocations, now this, this is the, dude, it worked, it worked though. I mean, it, it simulated the same thing as a floor press, but you weren't laying on the dirty ass floor, which who wants to lay on the fucking floor? You know, people in there squatting barefoot and shit. No, 300 pounds, 300 pounds, not 300 kilograms. Fuck no, dude. 300 kilograms. That's that's getting into like record setting benches. It would be like 136 bench in kilograms. What is your average calf press? I haven't done a calf press in probably a year and a half. My trainer doesn't really focus on calves. He's just like, they're going to come along with everything else. It's a waste of your time. I'm like, okay. And considering the level this guy competes at, I trust his advice. So anyway, back on topic. So I like warrior a lot. I really like warrior. And especially in this game, it seems like Warrior is way, way better. He looks compressed. Why is he small? I don't know, he's not small. Is it is it the neck? He does look a little compressed. Maybe it's torso size, hang on. Let me see something. Body. Short legs. Let me put this like right at the middle. That's probably it. Without that, that make him a little more proportionate. Y'all think the head looks small still? I mean, I can increase the head size. You looking thick. Almost too thick with that armor on. Oh shit, we didn't do posture. We didn't do posture. He's got to have max swag walk. Max elbows and knee angles. 
And then he needs to hunch over like he's fucking Unga Bunga Man. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? What's up, bro? The neck? I think the neck... His neck isn't thick enough. Now that I'm, like, seeing him move... The neck... The neck and the traps need to be bigger. Thicken up that neck some, boy. There we go. Alright, that looks more natural. I think it was the, the neck. I think the neck was... The neck was throwing him off. <laughs> He's gonna fly away, bro. So, all right. Anyway, back back to vocations. I mean, honestly, I think the the two. Well, here, let me let me pull this up, so we can talk vocations. So. <clears throat> Warrior. That's that looks fucking good. And the thing is, Warrior in the last game was cool, but it it lacked a little something. And now now Warrior has like fucking great sword tackles from Monster Hunter, which could be a lot of fun. Could be a lot of fun. I've played Magic Archer before. It's one of the most broken fucking classes in the game, so I'm not doing that. Mystic Spearhand looks fucking insane. Mystic Spearhand looks like it's a goddamn Jedi. And it's only available to Arisen. Bulls says hi. What's is he is Bulls alive? He's been dead forever. Oh, it's a raid. The Farquad gang coming in. You you just missed us. We're we're making I've made myself. Do you want to do you want to see the overlay? New people. Ready? Here we go. Let's let's uh, let's, uh, uh right there. Okay. There we go. You ready? You ready? Oh God! Hang on. Let me kill display capture. There we go. Okay. You ready? Here we go. Look 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 at this. Look at the time. The time we have spent. I think his eyes are still a little too wide. The lips are in the right spot, though. I wish he would stay still instead of moving so much. We're, we're metagaming now. Yeah, let me let me adjust those eyes again. Eyes. Confirm. All right, so back to vocation discussion for our main dude, though. So, I mean, at the end of the day, we're gonna we're gonna do a hybrid, and and we need to knock Magic Archer out, right? Because we played that. Trickster looks pretty wild. But I don't think Trickster would be for my first playthrough. This is like something I'd mess around with on a stream playthrough, I think. So, what this really boils down to... ...is Warfare... ...which uses fucking everything... ...so that I can use a great sword and some magic and Mystic Spear Hand Spear... ...or... I just go super hard on Mystic Spear Hand and do Jedi teleportation shit.
But the jack of all trades vocation sounds pretty fucking wild. Use every weapon, learn different skills from each vocation. Can respond to any situation and create combos that cross vocational boundaries. Lower base stats require them to utilize additional strengths of different weapons. It's, it's like the ultimate quality build. So if we're doing if we're doing warfare, I don't know what to do to start. What would be a fun starting class? Do we just start as the warrior? Warfare definitely post dragon. I doubt it's that far. Because well, if it takes if it takes a while to unlock warfare. I would end up going Mystic Spear Hand, which means I should start as a fighter or a mage. What's weird is Thief Thief doesn't have like any upgrade. But this dude way too big to be a thief. He looks goofy just standing there. Should we just start him as a fighter, I guess? And then we'll just change him up as as things go on. Let's hear the voices. Yeah, I don't know why Thief and... Well, I mean, Archer advances into Magic Archer, but... I, honestly, I would have really in in a... Uh, in, like, a perfect world... What I would have liked to see... Let me, uh, let me grab these, and I'm just going to show you all a, th a thing we're going to do real fast. Um... I think it should have been like, can I just select this and move it? Yeah, it should have been like that. That. I think you should have had your like your four classes, right? And then that can chain into that. That can chain into that. Let me, let me minimize this guy. Move that up. Move you. So you would have had... Yeah. Like, that can go into there. Oh, shit. How do I stop that? Let go. Stop this. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's not fucking take the selection of that. Ah, it's doing the whole thing. You know what? Let me just, uh, I can do this easier in fucking Photoshop. Which I don't know if they're, they're planning on doing it later. You're welcome, MH. I mean, Assassin isn't in it at launch, at least. Uh, let's see. View, uh, layer, type, canvas. some Photoshop shit real fast here. Because this is what I think eventually, I think this is what they're going to end up doing. So 
so like something like where you have warrior warrior mage that goes into that 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 and then you have hang on, I gotta increase canvas size damage canvas size See, this is this is what's weird. So looking at where it's at right now, this advances into that. This advances into that. We have a hybrid here. We have a hybrid here. These two should have the hybrid of assassin. This is missing ranger. So there should be like a ranger class and then some kind of combination there. I don't even know where this just fits in. This is just like its own thing and same with warfare. So, I mean, at least based on where we're at now, it does seem like there's going to be more vocations that get added to the game later. Because at a, at a bare, absolute bare minimum, archers should turn into ranger and thief should turn into to something more advanced for thief. Because right now it's like, you know, oh, well, half half the tree has its, its shit. What about all over there over here, though? So... I don't know when the, that stuff's going to get added, but I, I think it I think it will be. I would be very surprised if we don't see uh, some type of update there. Yeah, well, I mean, warfare, I guess you could consider that a advanced physical as well. Should I play one? I mean, you should play one just because it's good. Do I want to go somber or gallant knight? This dude just he growls a lot. I don't know why he's growling so much. This one, this one sounds all oh, they sound almost identical. Let's go with Gallant Knight 2. And then for this, we can do Billy. There we go. All right. We got our first character done <laughs> and our official pawn gone. Only three more to go, chat. We're at what? Fucking two. Jesus Christ. How have we been doing this? We've been playing for two hours and 40 minutes. Two hours and 40 minutes, and we've created two fucking characters? Bruh. Alright, this is gonna be my first pawn. <clears throat> so, this is gonna be the main pawn of my Let's Play. I'm thinking, I'm thinking mage, I'm thinking support, I'm thinking buffs and heals, and I think we make her into a cat girl. Because that is what we do. 
tiny little cat girl. This one. All right, let's create. Let's create a base. Hmm. Start with this one. Oh, she's like meow. I kind of like the little leopard spots. Yeah, from what I understand, stats are... They're more tied to gear now than uh, level. So, like, if you play a bunch of sorcerer and then you switch, you're not like, Oh, well, too bad. You're going to be a useless warrior. We're going to change the hair anyway. Just based on the cat, I'm leaning... <sighs> this one or this one? This one's got bigger eyes. But there's something about great kitties, man. I love great kitties. Let's... Let's go with the this one. All right, we got our base head. All right. Body. Put this right at, like... Right at zero. She's got to. She's got to have some muscles. Lower body. We gotta give her a big old booty. Where's rear size? Does not skip leg day. Boom. Big old booty. Chest size. Boom. <laughs> titties. No, titties. Titties can be a, a bit, a little bit smaller, and give her like. Like there, like well, well balanced, well balanced. All right, first let's pick her. Let's pick the hair. Let's get the hair down, and then we'll go from there. Let's go with, stick with that one. All right. Some of these hairs look so weird on the cat. A balding cat. That looks, this looks so uncomfortable. Like, it just looks cursed looking at it. I kind of like this one. Cuz I feel like she wouldn't want she wouldn't want like hair getting in her way while she's casting and stuff. That one looks like a good cat haircut though. With the braids, I'm liking I'm liking 23 a lot. Kitty cat with twin tails? The furries are gonna have a heyday with this game. Or, 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 hang on. Well, should I... Should I make her human? And then for the second playthrough, we do double cats? Like all cat people for the second playthrough. Because then I like that idea because then for the second playthrough, I could make like a zippy, a zippy fast cat. And then that would fit more into like the thief, the thief archetype. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna go here. All 
Oh shit, I thought I just had to choose from- uh, I didn't even notice, there's like a bajillion pages. I'm liking the bottom one on one. She kind of looks like, um, what's her name from Banishers? Oh man, we can make some grannies. Let's go with this one. She kind of looks like the fucking chick from the first game with the, the sunken dead eyes and everything. Oh, we got elf ears. Oh man, it's kind of kind of got like, yeah, Antea. It kind of has a Siri thing going on here. Mm. This one looks like Zoe de Chanel. I'm leaning more towards the little elf ears. For for a support caster, I like the elf ears. Yeah, I saw the Yennefer one. Okay, let's... Her height is all the way at the bottom. So, that's like 5'3". Keep that musculature. She's got to be at least a little toned. There's no such thing as an adventurer that's doesn't have some toning. She got them traps. What's up, bro? You fucking lift. Take her traps away. She's gonna be a well since she's gonna be like a caster. I can probably I want her to be on the the smaller side of things. She's got really big eyes. Lower that a little bit. Caster can be beefy. I don't want mine to be beefy, okay? You can make yours beefy all you want. Pull her shoulders in. Chest thickness. It's how thick her overall chest is. So, like, there... Do they point out, or do they point in? <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. Uh, torso width. Elves are usually, like, really skinny. But not like anorexia skinny. Let me pull those out a little bit. There we go. Yeah, you know somebody's gonna make a crazy ass grandma. It just got a dump truck. A little bit to like 24. Okay. The waist size also impacts 
the size of the junk in the trunk. Posture. Dude, the far back posture looks so goofy. Let me, uh... Vocation, you're gonna be a mage. Your inclination... Emphasis on support, quick to aid allies in need, that's already done. Okay, now we can go back to this. Are, there, are her legs too long? Thank you, missing. She just doesn't, she doesn't skip ass day, bro. Listen, I'm an ass man, okay? Let my character have a, a, an ass, all right? She's an elf, she needs long legs. She's a short elf. She was shunned by her village. And that's why she, she uh, came along on the adventure. Now she walks bow-legged. Make her 811, tallest elf lady around. She's just taller than every other person. Proportions, I think, are, are pretty good. I think we can... She looks a little too shrewd there. Let me see if we can find a a softer face. One that's more like kind-hearted elf who wants to it's like a what was that one? It was like a Giga Chad face. Maybe that one? But she looks a little scared. I don't really like that. Granny faces. Um, hmm. Now, like her face is almost too skinny. This one looks angry, like she's going to tell you that she wanted a mocha latte and not a mocha chino or something. Let's start with let's start with with 7 and we'll just customize it to get it better, I think. I want the palest elf possible. Oh, I can make her like green though. Oh, dude, I could make her like a drow. Oh, man. But I could also just make her super pale. I think the neck's too high. The neck did get a, a fair amount of length. Let me, let me, I'll pull it in just a little bit. Now she just looks sweaty. But she should be well moisturized. And elves do not age, so she gets no wrinkles. Um, there's something off with her face. Is it the... 
I think it's freckles. Hang on. It's like she has like bruising on her face. I know. We'll we'll get to the the cheeks and everything. I'm trying to like fix the the bruising that's happening. Uh What would that be under? Oh, the dirt. Yeah, true. That might be it. No, dirt dirt is none. Well, let's let's focus on we'll we'll get get her her face done. She just looks surprised. Oh. Oh, hello, Arisen. Let's go like there. There. Angry. Concerned. Probably like there. Soften the brow a bit. We're getting there, man. Give her give it a second. Give it a second. The eyes are, are really sunken back too. We're gonna pull her eyes out a bit. Give her those Attila Battle Angel eyes. No. There. I with pull the eyes in a little closer together. Oh, should we just have her? Her eyes are closed because she's blind. Hmm. Female Gollum. <laughs> uh, nose. Pull the nose up a little. We're trying to make an elf, bro. She's a little elf. She's a, a, a tiny elf, okay? I think it's the it's the jaw. Let's let's focus on the jaw. Let's get get her get her a normal jaw and then that'll then we can round out everything else. She won't look as as weird. Yeah, like an over exactly, like an oversized pixie. Like, hello arisen. I have come to Is that jaw position? Let's do like there and there. She needs cheeks too. We'll, we'll, we'll get back to the eyes. Relax. Relax. Let's give her some higher cheekbones. Make them a little wider. Add a little depth to them. Leave this right at zero. Uh, her mouth. She's got a very tiny mouth. That's how far out the mouth goes, right? Let's put that go sort of like a default. A little smile, thicken up her lips a little bit. Okay. 
max lip thickness. Just, mm, just big old lips. No, it doesn't look. No, I think like right where we had it is good. Like right there. No, maybe a little thinner. All right, the cheeks. I think I want like really high cheekbones on her. Okay. Okay, make her... We gotta pull... Alright, let's fix her eyes. What is, uh... I think she's too small. We need to, we need to size her up some. So, like, 170-ish. No, I want her like five, five eight would be like one seventy six. That seems like a good because elves are usually taller. Alright, she's looking a little more appropriate proportions now. Except she still's got that huge dump truck. Yeah, we haven't even got to the nose yet. The nose... Should... She's got like a little pixie nose. Was it the protrusion I need? Mm, I think there's not enough depth there. All right, now she's looking. We're we're getting the the elfishness down, with the the pointy ears. Let me pull the tilt in slightly on them. I think you can make a small fat guy and still go Mystic Spirit. I mean, you could. Yeah, hey, magic. I mean, her cheeks don't have a lot to them. So 
She still has like a lot of just like blemishes on her face, which is weird. I don't know how to get rid of the blemishes. I think I want to tweak the eyes a little. Hmm. Okay, white, what, what? What color hair do we go with? Oh, leave, listen, the eyes let, let's, all right, here, let me put some makeup on and then the eyes will probably look fine, okay? Lips go for like a pink. Wait, is this even... Oh, I gotta... So that's like the little... It's the metallic on them. That's it. That's it. Yes, the almond eyes. That's what we're missing. I'm like, the eyes are fine. Leave them alone. But it's the, it's the angle. That's what we don't have the... There we go. Now, now it's more elfish. We didn't have... We had the... And then, honestly, I think we need to squint them in a little bit to, like, 70. And then... Notch size down just a little bit. All right, now she just looks like she's baked. Pull them out a little bit. All right, that's looking better. Little more angle. Like there. She can bake, she's just a tree elf. I don't know shit about makeup. Go wake up my wife. How do I how do I do the makeup? What do I do? She's like, you woke me up for this? You woke me up to put makeup on your little imaginary elf girl? Nice. Mm. This is one of the most comprehensive character creations I've seen in a while. Yeah, it's... It's up there. There are, uh, very few games that I can think of that have character creation this in depth man I watched a makeup tutorial let's go like rosy I don't like how metallic looks Alright, that... Yes. No blush? Why no, why no blush? What did we do? We did, went with seven. Hmm. 
Oh, oh, there we go. All right, now we can. Is it? Is it the? Oh, it's the metallic color. All right, there we go. Now we're now we're actually like seeing the color of the lips. Give her like the goth lipstick. Mm. Part of me wants to do like, make her like a goth elf. Yeah, emo elf. A little bit of metallic, good sheen. Type four. All right, let's cancel. Black doesn't look good there though. So let's keep that as a darker red. Eyeliner, we need dark eyeliner. Let's see. Seven or twelve. Kind of like how that just goes over the pupil. Thirteen looks pretty good, too. Yeah, we haven't we haven't gotten to the hair yet. We we picked picked a hairstyle and we haven't done anything with the hair. Kind of like like the ashen or do are we just going straight black? The dark lipstick shade feels a little edgy. Yeah, but I don't know, man. What are we doing here? Go blazing red. I don't know if there's a blazing red. Let me see. The closest to... That, I guess? 39? Twenty six is close to that's more maroon. That's more, I don't know, that's more of like a chestnut, though. There's not like a, 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 a red, red, like a fiery red. So what I might be able to do is go for the maroon and then on the tips do Where was it? What was the other one I was saying? Like that I like the red, and then while we're on that, let's do... I want like a very... I want like a green that pops.
Like she just straight up has emeralds for eyes. Does she have the dark, the dark? No, nah, that gets a little too edgy, I think. Alright, let's go back to the makeup. Maybe I change the lipstick and the cheeks a little. The red, the red lipstick would work with the red hair. Maybe like an in-between black and red. She looks like she's going to stab your party when they're not expecting it. If I increase the head size, what if I do the head length to like 50, but then I move the face up at some. And then... Hmm... Purple lipstick, the green eyes. I like how we got like 900 dudes in here and we're like, yeah, what's the, the, pur the purple lipstick? Yeah, bro. Yeah, I think purple looks fucking awesome. Let's go with that one. She's still a tiny support mage. Darker purple, bro. We got us keep with the goth theme. Darker purple. Yeah, darkness. Darkness is like my heart after she breaks it. Not everyone's dudes, but there's probably a lot of dudes. I, I don't know if I'm sold on the red hair. I don't know. Let me... I kind of like... I don't know, man. I keep going back to like the ashen, like the gray... Tell dudes to play with Barbie dolls. They're like, get the fuck away with me. Tell dudes to make an elf girl in a video game. Sign me right the fuck up. Yeah, I'm leaning. I'm leaning more and more towards like the ashen. Is that like an ashen red? Oh, bro. We gotta, we gotta change the lighting. Slightly lighter ashen. No, uh, 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 uh. this one. Mm. 
Maybe I change the root color to be a little lighter because it's like fading away. It was red, but her, her real hair is like a silver. Gotta have that like dark eye shadow. There, now she's got those, uh, now she's got those like smoky eyes. And then this I'll turn down a little bit. Teeth, I think, are fine. I think I gotta pull her eyes back a little and pull her cheeks out. Oh God. I don't think you can give her, like, vampire teeth. I could, like, take away... <sighs> He's an Alabama elf. Hey! <laughs> Invite me to your party! <laughs> A <reason. laughs> Name her Bethany? <laughs> Fucking peak. Oh, that is so good. I'm half and I can't do it, but I'm I'm really tempted to do it. Oh god. My name is Methany. <laughs> Soda, give us give us give us makeup advice. What what do I need to change on the makeup to make it look good? I need a non-bro opinion. Um, if I give her black cheeks, that's going to just look weird. Maybe I powder the cheeks to better accentuate the dark, the eyeliner more. And like the eyeshadow. I don't know, man. With a name like Grumpy Cloud, I don't know if you have a bro opinion or a non-bro opinion. Soda has lipstick in her little profile picture. So I assume... She knows lipstick and makeup. Your profile picture is like a cat or something. More lashes. We didn't even do lashes. We didn't even get to lashes. Fuck. How do we miss lashes? Eyelashes. Long eyelashes. Dense eyelashes. Maybe I maybe the eyeshadow. Now she looks like a raccoon. I think I like the outer eye shadow more. Well, that one's kind of good too. That that gives her that gives her like a little bit of a cloudy eye thing going on. 
something dark on her cheeks to remove the oily glisten appearance. What? Nah, the official pawn's already done. The official pawn is a badass lion, bro. Well, that's why her cheeks are... Right now, we, we made the cheeks white. We tried to, like, pale her up a bit with the cheeks to make the eyes pop more. I think we need to... No, maybe we get rid of the freckles. Smoky look in the outer edges. No blush, dark lips, no blush. So no blush. It was smoky look in the outer edges. So this one. Do we give it a metallic sheen? Oh, that'll that'll pump up. That'll give it more of a smoky. But is that too much smoky? I feel like elves could have freckles. She does have a very tiny mouth. We can... Small mouth adjustment. Still wish I could get her blemishes. She got like a lot of just like blemish, but there's no I don't know how to I don't think we can. Let me let me see. Face. Makeup. We did eyes. We did eyelashes, eyeshadow, eyeliner. We got rid of the freckles. I see it, Ruby. I just wanted to say thank you. Managed to beat Dark Souls for the first time. Discover the true game. You're very welcome. Go to freckles. Like, this is no freckles, and then little freckles, 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 freckles all over. So if we were going to do freckles, I would do, like, type 2. I mean, we can do the the black, just the the dark as night lipstick. And match ass with the sub. Yeah, I didn't see blemishes earlier. Let me let me go back and look though. Height, head, face height. I can make her glisteny, or add wrinkles, or remove them. <coughs> this one, I think, might have less blemishes. I think the base skin certain... Oh, there we go. That's getting... I think... 18 is... Closer. Oh, 
think 17. Twenty seven might be better than seventeen. She looks like Bride of Chucky. <laughs> she does a little bit with the, the green eyes. I could work like, so like a purple, I could work into the eye. Right, yellow? No, what? Yellow. I mean, we can look through a bunch of eye colors. The white kind of looks wild. This looks like a Cabbage Patch Kid. Well, you know what? It's hard to change everything. She does have a little a little free ren thing, but free ren doesn't smile at all. Though I do kind of want to make her have that like apathetic face where she doesn't smile, she just like stares at you disappointingly. I think less lip thickness. Ears protruding? Bro, she's an elf. They're supposed to protrude. All right, is our is our goth elf girl done? What do we think? Any any final changes? I like the smoky and I like the eyes. I'm still I'm not sure on the hair still. I'm a little I'm a little back and forth on the hair. Let's look through some other hairstyles. I think 46 is going to be the winner. Give her that aberral hair. I 
I kind of like, where was it, 33? I kind of like that. What's, what's the hair do we get? The braids? Oh, man. So torn. We could give her a pixie bob. Unless she really looks like an elf with her little pixie haircut. Thirty-three. Yeah, I like thirty-three a lot. Ah oh, man. But I also I like that this has like braids in it. Because braids feel very elvenish to me. The eye squint is not lopsided. It shouldn't be, at least. No, same squint, same angle. The eyes are, are perfect. Pixie Cup makes me think X Men. She looks like an 80s movie bartender. Looks like a vampire. Just use the braids and play the game. Once again, we're not playing the game today. This is not the game. This is the character. This is specifically called Dragon's Dogma 2 Character Creator and Storage. This is literally just a standalone install for you to create your character. That's it. Let me look at hair color. Oh man, I'm so torn. I think I think I'm happy. Let's see with the equipment on. Hmm. Hmm. Reverse hair roots and tip. Let's try it. Uh, what are we at? 10 and 26. I don't know. I don't like the black roots. I don't know. The black the black roots she starts to get like a uh She starts to get kind of a, uh, like a Wednesday Adams thing going on. No, there's no, there's no real bold colors. They've actually kept it like somewhat grounded you can't go like neon green for the hair or anything mm, I do kind of like the blonde with the green eyes though blonde and green eyes is it's a good combo <sighs>
I mean, wouldn't it make more sense that the roots are going gray? Maybe, maybe we just get rid of the gray. One color is the play. I mean, all you would have to do is just remove that. It's like a very deep red. Oh man, I'm so torn. Let's look at her in different lighting. I don't know, man. I think the gray... I think there was something about the gray that just really looked good. But I don't know. I am leaning towards the red, too. Let me go... What about if I go 18 and then... I go, like, 20 there. Just a very slightly darker. <sighs> How do we feel about this red? No, though, you know what? If I'm going away from the gray... I feel like I should almost... Oh, that looks kind of good. The, the black... The black roots... But with the twin tails... But it hides her ears! Maybe, maybe I do kind of like the the gold and black. Like naturally, she has blonde hair because she's an she's an elf, you know. Well, or no, it would be the other way. Or hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I would need to do that, and then give her like the blonde for the roots, you know, because she keeps dyeing her hair black because she's like a goth elf, but the hair pops through because it's she's naturally blonde. That, that could be, that, that could be it. And she's been on an adventure, so she hasn't had a chance to, you know, touch up her dye yet.
lower the root tip blend it it won't go the way you're thinking it'll it'll make more of her hair blonde i wish it could go all the way up to the roots i don't know why it doesn't the only way to do that would be i'd have to go to uh that looks terrible uh, I would have to go to the other hair. I'd have to go to this one. If I went to that one, then you can see the blonde coming through, even though she's dyed it. You know what? Let's just give her that. She's still okay. Go to nine? That's nine. No. I could go like a black and white. What if we we do we want, do we want the blonde or the white? We've, we've gone, we've gone through like the whole spectrum of colors. I like the black on the ends. Let's, let's throw it up to a pole. I like the black, the black on the tips, because it's like, you know, she's been, she's been dyeing her hair and it's just getting away from her, right? But for the roots, so we could go like white like that, or like a very bright white, that's almost too white. Damn, red and blonde got blown the fuck out. Everyone voting for the white hair. Her skin is so light, having light colored roots turn to mush. I don't know about that. Well, she wants to be goth, but you know, she's an elf, so that hair just keeps, it keeps growing out. There's also the ooh, there's also the silver color that I was uh, the one I was doing at the start that I think looked really good. Uh, this one, but then it would suggest she's getting older, but you can't notice because elves don't age. This is more like a blonde white. That's like a, this is like the stark, the stark contrast white. That's like really white. No, this is more of a blonde white too. All right, let's check her voice. The people here are evacuated. No. Safe. For the moment. The people here are evacuated and safe. The people here are evacuated 
and safe. There are more who can yet be saved. The people here are evacuated and safe. There are more who can yet be saved. The people here are evacuated and safe. For the moment, there are more who can yet be saved. It seems the rain has abated. The people here are evacuated. It seems the rain has abated. It seems the rain has abated. Two, three or four. Former, former arisen appear to be plentiful in this world. Five, no, five sounds way too, too yuppie. Danger might lurk anywhere. Danger might lurk. A fine showing. Danger might lurk anywhere. Danger might lurk anywhere. I, I think she should have a, a little more of like a sultry. A fine showing. A fine showing. Very well. I shall await further orders. I'd fain lead the way if you would be so kind as to follow me. I'm leaning three. I'm thinking three. All right. Now we got to pick a name. Three, my lord. <laughs> three. Pick three, my lord. Oh, man. I still gotta. Ugh, it's like midnight. I gotta go to bed. I can't believe how long it took just to make characters. That's fucking wild, dude. You're not naming her Methany. <laughs> I want an emo, an emo elf name. I googled female dark elf names. Um, Luna fits the hair. That might be a manicure. What was that one? Lee. Libby. Liz. Lucia, Lucy, Lulu. How is there no Luna? Silverin. I kind of like Celine. Selma. Priscilla, she gets she does ooh, Primrose. All right, we'll do that for the moniker. <sighs> Silvana has a mystique to it. Hmm. We're not naming her Methany. Give up on Methany. It's not. It's not happening. Agatha. <laughs> but bro, please nothing. You can make your own methany and and have half her teeth missing. Celine because of the first game. That was the name of the the like the goth girl, wasn't it? Lilith is a little too on the nose. Um, I'm 
Licia. Broomhilda. Jesus. I do like, I, I always have liked Liliana. Liliana's a good name. Lanirsa exudes power. Mm. Lexapro. It's a character, not a photocopy company. I'm I'm leaning towards Liliana. Let's see if there's a Lily. Li Lillian. Kiara? I hear Kiara, I think blonde. Liana, Liliana, how's it going to have Liana, Lillian, but not Liliana? Oh, I'm having second thoughts about the white hair. I'm really, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. I just wanted, I hear it. You know what? All I want is, I want it a little darker. Right there. I don't I don't need a full name. So, oh, so for those that weren't here, this is the, uh, look at, look at him, look at him, bro. This is going to be the official pawn that gets uploaded. Dude is an absolute behemoth. Sarosh. I love him. He's so good. All right. I mean, we could be good for now. The only reason I would make another set would be for a second playthrough. Yeah, so right now, this this would be my pawn, and this would be my official pawn, which I also plan on, on using in my party. <laughs> I'll have my pawn and my official pawn. <laughs> um, all right, I... Gotta have a second Arisen. Yeah, I, I should in the event that I end up doing a Let's Play series and a 
a stream series. Um, because I don't want to be like 20 episodes into the Let's Play and then be like, okay, let's go out on a side quest. I mean, I could. But I mean, the next game that would get recorded would be, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, the next episodic game after this would be like Stellar Blade, April 26th. So I have like a whole, I have a whole month of Dragon's Dogma episodes. I think it'll be good for streaming, but I also think I'm going to do episodes with it too. I don't know. I was I was looking through the the like early previews of Rise of the Ronin and I'm sure it'll be fun, but this just hits a little different. I think it's just the fact I've been I mean, I wanted to cover both, but the more I think about it, I'm like, bro, I've been waiting fucking 12 years for a new Dragon's Dogma. Small land? Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Alright. Either way, it is, uh, it's midnight. So let's wrap up. Um. I'll probably make a, I'll probably make a second set of characters. But considering how long it's taken, that sounds like a uh, that sounds like a tomorrow stream sort of thing. Took four hours to make three. We're gonna need uh, yeah, we're not. I, this ain't turning into a six-hour character creation stream. <laughs> so we'll close out here. I'll probably make two more tomorrow. I might fiddle around with it off stream. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, either way, y'all have a good night. I'm heading out, and I will. Catch y'all later.